Kunrakan 5 in 1 Master Auto Safety Can Opener. Now, we featured this earlier in the show, one of our hot picks, one of our best selling items of the day. And we've already taken orders for. Oh, my word. 10,000 of these are gone. We began the show with 13,000. I have 10,000 out the door. That means 3,000 left to go around, fewer than 3,000. Now, this one tool will do five jobs in your kitchen. Now, what are those five jobs? Do you have a liter or two liter bottle of seltzer or soda in your kitchen? Those lids can be so hard to open. Not anymore. Did you hear that little snap? And now that seltzer bottle is opened with ease. Move over here to a bottle of root beer. Need a little church key to open that up. Boom. Done and ready. Want to open up a can? No, I'm not going to go like this, like a regular can opener, because it doesn't work that way. It works on top of the lid. Turn it this way until it grabs the lid. And what it's doing now is reversing the crimp. And when I get all the way around the can and the tension changes, I go counterclockwise to release the lid lifter and use my little bird beak to take this off. This is now smooth to the touch. I don't have to worry about any cutting of myself or the trash bag. Next, I've got a bottle of olives, but these are vacuum sealed. Can be a little tough to open. See this little clip underneath here? I'm going to release the vacuum seal. Go underneath here, just pull up a bit until the vacuum is released, and now that lid comes off as pretty as you please. And then finally, pop top cans. How many of you are buying soup, in this case chicken noodle, that has a pop top? Maybe it's canned vegetables, maybe it's dog or cat food. Now you've got a little bird beak to open that up and you're ready to heat up your soup. The most important thing to realize here is that one tool is doing five jobs in your kitchen. And we can eliminate five tools in your kitchen. And if one of them is this old can opener, please throw that away as soon as this <coughs> arrives. Because this is covered with rust and bacteria. And every time you open up a new can, you're introducing rust and bacteria into that new canned good that you're opening. I think you, your family, and your pets deserve something a little better, don't you? Let me get a little drink. Mm. Wash down my Corazona squares. And then we're going to talk to you about fla uh, flavors, colors. They look like flavors, don't they? This is your green. Started with 2,500 green. I have 900 remaining. If you want the red, we began with 4,500 red, 1,500 left in the red. Here's aqua. 200 left in the aqua, now last call, and in the black. And black just sold out, so black is gone. Many, many of you are picking up your Kunra Khan today. And let me tell you that this is something you've been waiting on coming back in stock. Many, many of you are sending messages on social media saying, David, when is the Kunra Khan 5-in-1 coming back? It's here, but now getting limited. Now, we brought in 13,000 of these for our show tonight. I have how many remaining? 2,200 left, but only three color choices. One of our colors, the black, has sold out. This will open up your one or two liter soda bottles. Church key that'll take the lid off your beer bottles or birch beer. A can opener that will lift the lid, leaving it with no sharp edges. A clip that will release the vacuum seal. And a bird beak that will take care of your pop top cans. Let's remind you of colors and tell you Aqua just sold out. Only the green and red remain at this point. If you want the green, I have fewer than 800 left. If you want the red, 1,200 in the red. And how many folks on the phone lines? A thousand people on the phone lines waiting to place their order. Let me encourage you to not wait. These will go very, very quickly. And a lot of us now are excited about those two remaining colors, and they're jumping on those quickly. All right, we want to check in with Miss Julia and ask her about the chat tonight. Oh, the chat was so much fun as always. You